Okay, hello everyone, Michael Strauch here, Computer MD of Gilbert, and today we are going to be discussing a Gmail tutorial. Now, I know you may all be saying, well, Gmail is very simple to figure out, and the truth is, yes, it is very simple to figure out. Ah, no, 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 there's an I, so I'm in my email right now, okay? So, right off the bat, up here at the top on Google, you see Michael Plus, uh, search images, maps, play, YouTube, news, Gmail. We're going to be under Gmail today, uh, but these are all Google's products up here, all free also. So that's really cool. All right, so when you're in Gmail, you have a few tabs on the left side. You have Compose, and then under Compose, you have Inbox, Start, Important, Sent Mail, and like your drafts. So those are th uh, the drafts of the email maybe you didn't finish or you've saved. Um, now these are your main things for your email right here so obviously your inbox is where you receive the mail your start is on gmail when you press that star that sends it to start as you can see now it's right there so i'm gonna unstart though and it'll be back in here important are these little yellow arrows that point at it that means important and your sent mail is the mail you uh... sent out and then as i said before your drafts are like your saved emails and stuff like that Now. These are very simple parts. You all know these, most people. Receive email. Compose, you just click compose. You write the email to the person you want. Um, now, uh, you see circles here. This is for your Google Plus, okay? So you could have your circles on here. And then, see, this brings me to my circles up here. So circles are a pretty cool thing. Um, they just, it's people you connect with on Google Plus and you just add them to your circles. So, and, I mean, that's a pretty cool thing. Um, but now, up here where you see Gmail, you also see under Gmail when you click on Gmail, that little arrow next to it, you see contacts. And the, these are my contacts. That brings you to your contacts, your co whole contact list. And the way you input a new contact is press new contact and put them in. And then you also see tasks. So the cool thing about tasks is you could, down here in the bottom right corner on my screen, you could see it says tasks. And you could create tasks for yourself. And you just enter them. And once you enter them, um, I'll just write make video and then it saves it there for you so that's pretty cool and then when you don't want it anymore just click it and delete it so that's really cool um, but as you can see gmail is super simple to use you could do uh, a hangout or the call phone as you can see down here you see call phone so if i was to call my phone you would hear it come through but you need the voice plugin to make a call so that's pretty cool and then the hangout is uh google hang really new and it's pretty cool too um but uh yeah i have to install the plugin i haven't used it yet i've used it on a different computer uh like a online hangout chat spot on uh google and then under here you have you and then some of your contacts or recent emails that you've sent and really that's a crash course on gmail um up Oh, I will show you a few more things. Uh, up here in the search bar, you could search your inbox. So if I typed eBay, you would see it comes up because I used eBay today. And then over here to the right side, you see settings. Now, here's a cool thing. Um, well, I'll show you this, and then I'll show you something cool. These are all your settings of Gmail. So this is your, uh, well, there, as you can see, there's a whole bunch of tabs. But... The, these are your signatures, how many conversations are, how many emails per page, uh, archives, replies, stuff like that. Your labels, inbox, your accounts. Now, uh, you could also add a forwarding email to this e your email address. So that's all your settings. But the thing I wanted to show you is, if you come here under this little settings gears icon and go down to themes, you could click themes. And the mines mountains, and it creates a cool theme in the background. And you pick your theme, and it's real cool. And um, so 
that is pretty much a crash course on Gmail. Pretty simple, I know, but I just figured I would throw it out there for some people. Alright, thank you everyone, and follow up on the next videos. Remember, the link to my website, theteentech.com, is down below. Something real cool, real quick about my website that I'll show you right now is that um, we just implemented a members. Uh, so we're taking memberships now. Now, here's the very cool part you scroll down. And it's a hundred percent free right now. It's our launch price because I just launched it last night, and it's a hundred percent free. Go on and be a member because look at all this stuff you get access to. You get access to tons of blog posts that will benefit your knowledge of the computer. Get access to weekly FAQs answered through video, uh, email support. There's a whole bunch of stuff. Live chat, uh, surprise video footage, member updates, social features with friends, group chat, uh, FAQs. Yeah, so there's a whole bunch of stuff. So that's theteentech.com, and I'm going to put it in the description below. Go become a member. It's something you guys would really, really enjoy. Um, I already have a few members on there, and they love it, and they keep telling people. So that's real great. All right, everyone, go ahead and go onto the site. Hope you enjoyed my uh, tutorial.